Hey guys, this week's video is on the vocoder inside of Reason and Record. And this is how to vocode your voice. And I know I already have a video on it, but this one is going to take it to a, uh, change it up a little bit and hopefully it'll be a little bit more easier to understand what I did in the last video. Anyways, you're gonna open up a new session and I'm gonna switch over to my rack, right click and create an audio track. Right away, I'm going to mute that with this mute button right by the audio track label. And underneath that, I'm going to right click and create a Thor. You can use any synth you want, but for this, for the sake of this tutorial, I'm just going to use the Thor. Right click on the Thor and create a BV512 digital vocoder. Now I'm going to flip my track around, hit this drop down arrow on the audio track, and then show insert effects. Then come over to the insert effects section and take the left to device and drag it down to the modulator input. I'm going to flip it back around now, head over to my main mixer. As you can see, this is already muted. And I'm having some mic problems today, so I'm going to boost my vocoder up a little bit. I don't want to boost my audio up, just the vocoder. Now I'm going to switch over to my sequencer. And then what you need to do is arm both audio track and your Thor 1 track. The reason being is you need to record both MIDI and audio signals at the same time. Your Thor is what is controlling your vocoder, and your audio is what's going into your vocoder. So if you only record one at a time, you only have one or the other, and it won't play back right. So I'm going to go ahead and click on my pre-count, turn the click level down just a little bit. I'm going to hit record, and I'm going to record something and let you know what it sounds like. This is what my vocoder sounds like. How does it sound to you? All right, so maybe you didn't like the sound that I just played. We can go back over, open up the file finder. I'm gonna come down to my lead synths and let's find something else. How about the Valkyrie or Valkyrie? Switch over so you can see it, and we'll play it again. This is what I don't sounds like. How does it sound to you? So it's so easy to find a new patch and find whatever you want to sound like. You can even create your own, whatever you want to do. You can hook this up to a combinator if you want to. Anything goes in this. If you guys want to download this file, because I'm going to upload this just like I always do, there will be a link in the description to my blog, which will also have a link to where you can download it from. And if you have any other questions, maybe not even a question about the vocoder, go ahead and post in the comments below this video, or head over to my blog again, and there is a contact page with my email, and you can contact me from there, and you always get a reply.